Welcome, and thank you for joining us for today's encouragement from our Daily Bread on the 24th of February, 2024. The Bible reading today is Ecclesiastes chapter 4, verses 9 to 12. Two are better than one, because they have a good return for their labour. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. But pity anyone who falls and has no one to help them up. Also, if two lie down together, they will keep warm. But how can one keep warm alone? Though one may be overpowered, two can defend themselves. A cord of three strands is not quickly broken. Today's article, titled Better Together, was written by Wynne Collier. Sir and Solcaire spent years photographing starlings and their breathtaking spectacle, murmurations, where hundreds of thousands of starlings move in fluid motion across the sky. Watching this marvel is like sitting underneath an orchestrated, swirling wave or a massive dark brushstroke flowing into a kaleidoscope of patterns. In Denmark, they call this starling experience Black Sun, also the title of Solcaire's stunning book of photographs. Most remarkable is how starlings instinctively follow their nearest companion, flying so close that if one were to miss a beat, they'd suffer mass calamity. However, starlings use murmurations to protect one another. When a hawk descends, these tiny creatures enter tight formation and move collectively, beating back a predator who'd easily pick them off if they were alone. We're better together than we are alone. Two are better than one, Ecclesiastes says. If either falls down, one can help the other up. And if two lie down together, they will keep warm. Alone, we're isolated and easy prey. We're exposed without the comfort or protection of others. But with companions, we give and receive help. Though one may be overpowered, Ecclesiastes says, two can defend themselves. A cord of three strands is not quickly broken. We are better together as God leads us. Let's pray. Dear God, please help me to commit to being in community and extending your love. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name is Mike, and today's encouragement was provided by our Daily Bread Ministries.